Hello friends, in this video I will talk about the security measures which should be taken when making an Android app or publishing it on any platform just like Google Play Store or Amazon mobile platform. Then, first of all we have to generate the APK for our application so we'll generate it from here. Click on the generate shine bundle slash APK. Next, then I will already have given the password and chosen the key uh, that you can see the video, the previous video. I have provided you the link of that video in the description. So I will simply put the password here. Then I will confirm the password. Because the password of uh, key store and key was same that's why I said I'll come from the password click on the next next then here we have to wait for some time so the APK has been generated I'll simply click on this dialog box and click on analyze the APK click on it here you can see the content of our APK. Cunning people can vulnerable this app or take other advantage of your coding. So first let me show you the text classes. There's the compile decompile code. There's all the sources and the packages we used. They are here. So I simply Click on com and then android it. actually that was the name of my package com.android.covid19 tracker so I'll so I'm in this part covid19 tracker I'll expand it now you can see that all my classes are listed here I have used this four classes and they are here one two three four then you can see that the functions are there and the variables are there they are completely shown everywhere so i want to protect my code i don't want that uh, my code has available to everyone or the function that I have used should be would be known to the people who are seeing my app or decompiling my APK that they, they can download it from the Play Store or wherever I publish my application so I'll tell you the trick now so first of all we go into the build cradle and we are going to use ProGrad files to minify the code so we'll true it make it true and also come here in ProGrad rules.pro and just remove that has tab Okay, now click on the sync now, wait for some time, so now I'm going to regenerate the APK of my app, so I'll click on the generate sign, click on next, and the password. Next. Next finish. APK has been generated. Then we'll reanalyze it. Click on the tax. Go on the com and write it. Here you can see that only one class is available here that is main activity and one method that is on create by default it is provided by Android is there. So here we successfully able to hide our code 
and this is something called a cunning thing that you should always take in your mind when making a android app so the apk has been generated as 